What's going on? Out here walking my son. Shit, feel good out here. I'm gonna talk about um, pain in this video. And you know, some people ask the question, why do we feel pain? Or is pain real? Um, and talk about it for a second. I've seen a couple YouTube videos yeah. from, uh, you all right? Good. I seen a couple YouTube videos from some people. Uh, they was talking about like pain. They gave some good, um, good talks about pain, right? And I'ma just kind of recite it in my own words. One thing was, uh, pain is in our senses, right? We got five senses. Um, one of those things, whatever, our nerve system or whatever, right? Send signals to our brain that says, hey, this hurt, or I'm sad, or I'm depressed, or whatever, I'm feeling pain some type of way, right? We mostly are physical. And that's what puts us in this 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 uh, painful state, you know what I'm saying? State of mind, it's all in the mind. And, um. Some people say, how can a pain pill relieve pain? You could be in some excruciating pain, right? And take a strong pain pill that'll have you chilling, cool. Or you can get a shot, like when women have babies, they get that shot that help them have a baby without feeling pain. How is that? Now, you know, I done seen on videos, doctors saying, it's like a, the nervous system is like a, a tunnel, right? And the pain pill blocks the tunnel, right? So the, so the signal can't get sent to your brain that it's painful, whatever you're experiencing. So how the fuck can a pill block your nervous system signal to the brain? That, I don't know. But all I know is that's what's happening. And you can do all of the scientific, you know, the doctor proven suggestions or experiments you want. But, oh my God, they coming so fast. Let me let them go, man. Go ahead, man. I'm just about to go this way. <laughs> It's crazy, I'm doing this video, walking my son, this car's coming and shit. All right, now it's good. So, you can, uh, and excuse me, man, you know what I'm saying? I don't like to edit my videos. Hopefully you still bear with me with this. But if I um, take a pill, it blocks the nervous systems. It blocks the signal through my nervous system. That's, it don't send the signal to my brain saying I'm in pain. So that's telling me that it's all in the brain, right? Pain is all in your mind. So why do you think it's some people that can endure, they can endure uh, being tortured? Now, one analogy that the guy I was watching gave is, there was a guy getting tortured, right? And well, this is a, a, a example. A guy getting tortured, the, the the worst part of the torture experience is the beginning. You know what I'm saying? When he's just waiting till it happens, right? And so when it start happening, that's the worst part because his mind is filled with all types of thoughts of how it's gonna feel, what's gonna happen, how is he gonna die? Is he gonna die? Well, all that stuff, right? But after a while, you know, after getting tortured for a while, he starts to, it starts to become kind of normal. And he gives in to the pain, right? Now the pain isn't so bad as it was in the first, in the beginning, because your mind is adapted to it now because you have to give into it to live to 
actually live through it, through the experience. Because if you don't, you know, you, you, you can mess around and die from other reasons. You know what I'm saying? Mental reasons, heart reasons, whatever, right? So your mind is trying to survive. So it's saying, hey, hey, let's go along with this pain. Let's act like it's not that bad. And maybe it won't be that bad. And your mind does this automatically. So now the same thing they do, the same way they was torturing them from the beginning, after a while of getting tortured that way, you know, whatever they doing, it's becoming, it's just becoming an experience. They're not screaming as loud as they was in the beginning. You know, they're not doing all the other shit they was doing in the beginning as much. And what that's telling me well, what that says is, you know, we gotta live through pain. Pain is a part of pleasure, right? To switch it up now to another analogy that I heard is without pain, you, you can't really, you don't really know what pleasure is. You see what I'm saying? So, I don't know, kind of sometimes when you're feeling down or maybe maybe you're in some type of pain, just remember that when you was feeling good, remember that there's always two sides to everything. So you gotta feel pain to feel joy, to feel pleasure. It's duality, it's part of life. We, we run from pain though as humans, because it don't feel good. But if you kind of embrace it when it's happening, like the guy getting tortured, it won't be so bad. And then you can kind of get through it and get back to the pleasure part of life. And I'm gonna leave you with that, all right? Tap in in a minute, comment, let me know what you think about it. Holler in a minute.